mwananchi baba tunakushukuru sababu umetupatia nafasi ambao sisi kama binadamu hatukuwa na uwezo wa taarifa ya kufika siku ya leo umeona ni vyema sisi kama wana wangu tusajike hapa kwa binadamu ya kusikia neno lako kwa nasi tunapokuingia katika kipindi hiki cha kipekee ya baba tumeenda kusikia tupokee kupitia kwa neno jina lako Roho ya Mungu mtakatifu tuongoze ya baba tunaenda kutenda ya baba tunaenda kusikia baba ombi lako ni kwamba mwisho yote jina lako lipate sifa ni katika jina la Yesu sote tuseme amina amen Bwana asifiwe. Bwana kwako na furaha sababu ya leo. Anaona kwako na furaha. Basi sababu ya muda nataka nikupe muda mfupi sana ili niweze kufanya mambo ya karibisho. Oh, najua nimebarikiwa na wengi wengi sababu ya leo. Naomba mweze kujisikia huru na kwa kweli pamoja. Basi nipenda kutambua uwepo wa watoto wageni watoto wageni ni wale wa mkono kwa sana wa mkono huku msimame na mweze kuwevu kwa wakashiriki watoto wate msimame kwa raka na simame kwa watoto hawa e, karikuli sana na mjamasa kulapu wa kutipa moja basi ngependa pia kutakua uwepo wa wana siriku wa siriku wa geni wate ngependa kwa wale kwa sana ya mkono wasiriki wageni nasemaje kwa wasiriki wageni wageni amen mweze kujisikia huru na kwa kuwa pamoja basi kwa njia ya kipekee ningependa niweze kukaribisha wageni ambaye sio wanakoya wa Saika sio wanakoya wa Sabe sio wanakoya wa Kariba Misao ningependa kuona wageni kama hao kwa kati wetu yetu mbele ya yote ambaye tupi sehemu hizo ambazo nimetaja hakuna mbele ya yote ama eh kuna sawadi ambayo tuliangalia wageni special kama hao sababu ya leo ningependa kama tungekuwa na hata mmoja asipokee hii sawadi ni kama wako ama labda wameokoka kusimama basi kama mgeni kama utaona mgeni ambaye sio msiriki kati ya hawa sio mwanakwaya kati ya wale ambao tumetaja tutamtambua na tuone apate hiyo sababu yake basi naomba mwezi kujisikia huru na kwa wapi pamoja basi kwa njia ya kipekee kwa sababu ni sabato wa wale ambao na wanakwaya ningependa nikaibishe ile kwa director ili aweze kuleta wageni wake ambaye anaandika sana director thank you Happy Sabbath. Happy day. Eh, tena karibisha tena kwa njia ya pekee na yeye. Sabato ya leo. Basi ningependa niweze kukaribisha wale ambao watakuhudumia sabato ya leo. Mkono wangu kule uko na ndaa. Ningependa niweze kutupa salamu. Happy Sabbath. Happy day. Happy Sabbath. Karibu naye ni dada Ogendo au Mrs. Ogendo. Karibu. Na Ogendo na Kristo na wasalima mjambo. Amina. Yule ambaye atakuletea hadithi za watoto ni dada Amina. Amina karibu. Oh. Kuna wangu huku kuruka mbele wa pekee wa siku ya leo kwa na dada Messi Chanje Bwana asifiwe Amen na sauti kama ile na sina hapa yetu basi oh karibu naye ni director wetu wa kwaya ndugu yake karibu 
basi yule ambaye Mungu aliandaa sabato ya leo ili aweze kuhudumia oh ni ada pia ni magnetis bado yeye ndio Mungu alimchagua sabato ya leo aweze kuhudumia na pia aweze kufanya sehemu ambayo ndoona wakati wake takapofika wakati anamkaribisha nabi na wakaribisha wakati anamkaribisha
akili ambayo iliweka tia neno lako baada ya siku sita utapata mzigo Mungu tuko hapa kwa sababu hiyo kwamba kaleta mzigo wetu kwako Mungu kapata kumuisha mani ahadi ambayo kwa wote kwa ajili ya imani naamini kwa ubiri kutoka sadhi kwa ubiri kutoka karibani south na ubiri kutoka saika wamejiunga pamoja nasi hapa ngei kwa kusudi moja na kipekee bali na mziko kapate kufanya kazi ya kuendelesha kazi ya kipekee ya utume baba mbali tuma kwa ajili ya wote wanaoamini umetuwezesha kutupa nafasi kwa ajili ya matokeo haya Mungu tunaomba kwamba ukazidi kutimiza lengo hilo ambalo umetoa kwa ajili ya yako naamini Mungu zaidi ya mno msa haya nafasi ya kipekee kwa ajili ya kupata mkate ambao umewanda kutia kutumisha kwa kwenye tunamini ye ni mwandamu kwa kwa mpungufu kwa zaidi kwa mwandamu wengine lakini kwa jingi ya kati ya kipekee mungu na amini kwa mungu umewandamu zaidi ya mungu umemupa neno na kipekee kwa jingi ya watu hawa kwa kusuli moja tu kwa mungu wapate kwa andaliwa kwa jingi ya wakogu na zaidi ya mungu kweza kumiliki na kuwa sengi ya ufurumi ya mungu kika pembeleza dunia mwanao mali wanao kumejifulisha mungu na wangu kwa njia kipekee kapate kuwa kiongozi kapate kuwa nisha kiza mbalu mbalu kwa kia sisi ya njawa wana wako kutika semu mingi kazama kunao mpaka wafsaizi wanajiunga mzizi hini na kazama kuna wengi wa kiona changamoto mbali mbali ikuwemo changamoto ya kukosa kupewa na fasi kwa njia kujulisha siku ya kakatifu wa mazikia na kwa hiyo kwa njia kipekee kwa kwamba kuna yeye yote baada ya kuamini anapata changamoto kwa ajili kukosa kujulia siku ya ibada yake Mungu naomba kwa njia kipekee tuwawezeshe kama kama ni kazi Mungu afungie njia kwa wao waweze kupata kuruhusiwa kwenda kujisha kwa Mungu akiwemo kwa njia kipekee ndio kupata ngana ambaye ni mmoja ambaye amejiunga na kundi hili tazama kutokuwa na mashaka kuhusu swala hili na kupewa nafasi kujidhurisha kwa kizazi kile kinachofuata. Unapoandika kwamba kapata kunyosha kwamba zake jina ambapo mlimuruhusu kutia neno lako neno la nchini na kumruhusu kwa kapata kuwa mmoja katika zile zile. Baba naamini kwa hayo machache utazidi kunena nasi kwa roho mtakatifu kwamba katuandalia yale ambayo tayarena mbele yako. Ile ndio kundi letu na katika jina la Yesu Amen. Shall it be? Who always told Anna never to be a 
taking. So I learned slowly, but twice in the back of the leg. And the amazing thing was that the sisters say that they start from behind. So they went up to the back and gave Anand his gifts. So Anand thanked God because his blessings followed him where he was. And this story teaches us that we should be humble to God because our blessings will follow us wherever we go. Amen. As we do, even the story of Jacob blessing his grandsons, Ephraim and Manasseh, Joseph wanted Manasseh to be given good blessings than Ephraim. And the thing was that Jacob crossed his hands and gave him their blessings. Do you like my story? Yes, we do. Do you like my story? Yes, yes we do. So don't forget to come and give. Nasimane kwa story mzuri basi wakati huu ni wakati wa pekee ambao anakaribisha mshi wa Mungu basi kuna pamoja na sio kapi pamoja na nami anakaribisha God is good and all the time sasa kuhusu tu mwezi sitokea sio kutanga pesa Allow me to welcome you to today's program. I to brother Mungu, that is my name. But my full name is Mungu Mungu. The whole bit here is Mungu Mungu. I don't have a word to say about it. Kumbuka ya kwamba tuko katika sabato ya Bwana and all are welcome. We are privileged to be here today. Sio uwezo mwenyezi uwezo ya mtu yeyote lakini tupitie uwezo wa Mwenyezi Mungu. Nashukuru Mwenyezi Mungu kwa kupata nafasi mara nyingine. If it is the third then it is the fourth for me to be here today to share with you the word of God. Because when I come, when I go to the country, when I come from school for three years, when I go to the upper, when I say, say, I go to the Guanam, the South, the West, the day to the Guam, the Maori, the Sepak Sabi, the Bay to Nawana, Malay, Guanza. Allow me to, Sister Wendy, when I say I'm so much, how much time is it running? When I first come to the summer. Ungependa urudie na kulipa hapa. It was first read as 10 to 12. Reading reading from Ufuwe. I'm reading from NIV. Inasema. Mm. So if you think you are standing firm, mm. be careful that you don't fall. If you think that you are standing firm, be careful that you don't fall. It's a warning to us as Christians. It's a warning to us as choir members. It's a warning to us as elders. It's a warning to us for those who are wanting to go to heaven. Many of us we started very well. To catch your men and power to make a man. But Paul is reminding us that we need to be careful, or else we are going to fall. We had so many good choirs, but where are they today? We had so many good preachers, but where are they today? We had so many good churches, but you know what you can find in those churches? are just in fighting. And that's why today the Bible is questioning us that
If you think you are far, you will not go to your life. Because if you are going to go to your life, you will not go to your life. Safari na posonga na kuja kumi na tano. Paka umejiulisa kushida ni nini? Kushida. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, I humble myself before you. May you give me the Holy Spirit to speak to your children. Lord, don't allow any evil spirit to be in the midst. But I pray that Lord may you guide us so that those who are here today may all confess that Lord, they came here heavy burdened, but for sure now they have been relieved. Be with us and may you guide this program in Jesus' name I pray. Yes. Tunapata ya kwamba choirs zinavuma. Preachers come and go. Paka wanajiuliza shida ni nini? Let me remind you that music plays a very important role in our lives. Unapata ya kwamba kanisa bila choir is a dead church. Kanisa bila uimbaji is a dead church. Kwa sababu unasikia wahubiri wa nini? Wa kwanza. Shida inakuwa nini kwa ubira wa kwanza? Walianza safari wakiwa wengi. What has gone wrong? Na kuambia kwamba katika safari ya bali tunaishi inafaa tujenge imani yetu kwa Yesu Kristo. Huyu mpaka cha bali tunaimba inafaa tuiimbe tukijenge imani yetu kwa Yesu Kristo. Lakini mara nyingi tunapata ya kwamba sisi kama waimbaji we see for the sake of sin. The reason that can be kuimba to ours. Baada ya hapo baada ya watu wa ours. Haleluya. Alafu baada ya hiyo unafikiria wako na haraka wanaenda Hawaendi bali wanasemama pale hii inafanyika kama ifanyike. Haleluya guys. Inafanyika kama ifanyike. Unapata yule alikuja na haraka anachelewa ni kwa haraka kuliko yule ambaye anatumia. Na yeye kana kulima anafika mapema. Alafu anasikia, alafu yule anakuja na kuja 540 sababu anajua hiyo practice inaweza saa 12. Yeye mwenyewe ndiye hata Apollo yana ulisemewa kwa nini? Utasikia ile kasi ya Mungu. Not first. I'm telling you what the Bible reminds us today. That if you think you are strong, kama unaona kwamba you are strong in faith, brother and sister be careful you will fall. Kwa sababu unaona kanisa ni kuna masuku, misuko misuko kama ni nini? There are so many challenges. Kwa sababu unaona kwaya there is no peace in kwaya. That's all you will find there no peace in churches. Because they are not based their faith in Jesus Christ. Let us take Jesus as our Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Let me tell you, if our choirs would put Jesus first, when the way to yes to make the wakwanza, ata kuna haya hawa kwa yetu kuya kumubili. Sababu kizuri kakiu, but Brothers, tumeweka kiburi. Tumeweka kujua. Nasema na kwamba wewe unajua nini? Hii kwaya tumetoka baada. Tumetoa baada. Bila kujua ya kwamba hii kwaya ni ya Mungu. Hata kukosa leo kuingia. So what are you That's what I'm saying. Wahubiri wamekuwa wakihubiri mzuri. Lakini unapata kiburi inaingia. Mpaka tunakosa mwelekeo. A good choir must have a focus, must have a plan. Tu si hapa tu, tu si kujakani sasa. Nisababu na pata petro, 
Anauliza Yesu. Unatuambia tuwanya all our plans tukufuate. Ili tupate nini? Swali kuu ni kwamba wewe mwimbaji na Mkristo ambaye uko hapa jini ya kayota ambayo umekuwa ndani ya Ukristo hasili brought any change in your life ama unakuja at least for the sake you have ever been adventist be careful brother you might fall hasili brought any change unaniambia kwamba umetoa kwani umetoa but is there any element of it that is that you are too christian ambayo ukisoma katika John 18 yule msichana alipotazama Petro akamwangalia na akasema hapana kwa hakika wewe unakaa kama Mkristo kama yeye lakini Petro anakuita ah is there anything that can be seen in you that the seventh day advent is there anything that can be seen in you kwamba unakoje kurudi kwa Yesu na yeye ama wewe unaenda kwa step kwa wewe siku hizi ukiangalia we have something Old boys. Lakini after one year six months hawako. Mpaka unajiuliza wameenda wapi? Sababu ni kwamba hawajaweka msingi yao kwa Kristo. Msingi yako ni yipi? Kwa Kristo. Am I communicating? Msingi yako. What is your foundation as a Christian? Let me tell you Music has power. Music can influence. Music can educate. Music can comfort. Music can encourage. We need people with me one fast up when six sixteen twenty three. When we need a player music, we now realize that we must have tens to the tomorrow we buy to put your mind aside. We just compose songs for the sake of composing. That's the magic. Sixteen twenty-three verse seven. Sixteen first Samuel sixteen twenty-three. Mm. Whenever the spirit from God came upon Saul, mm. David would take his harp and play. Mm. Then relief would come to Saul. Mm. He would feel better. Exactly. And the spirit would relieve. Amen. Amen. The power of music. Atakama. Ugonjwa ni ugonjwa. Nasikia kwamba wapenzi wa Bwana nitenda ni sasa kuimwa kichwa. Then sisi kama waimbaji why are you not taking this opportunity to evangelize? Kwa nini tunapokuwa tunachukua tu muda yetu badala kupeleka injili nje tunakaa ndani ya kanisa? Let us transform this choir to be evangelistic choir. Hallelujah. Tengenezetu mzee 
pamoja Naimba aje Yes, I will read it. The tablets were the work of God. The writing was the writing of God and read on the tablets. When Joshua heard the noise of the people shouting, when Joshua heard the noise of the people shouting, he said to Moses, There is the sound of all the people. Hallelujah. Ipo za vita Tunaweza dhani tunaimba Kumbe tunaweza nyimbo ambayo ipende ipende shifa kwa nani kwa Mwenyezi Mungu Wimbo gani unaimba Wimbo gani una compose Continue It is says mm. Moses replied mm. it is not the sound of victory It is not the sound of victory It is not the sound of defeat mm. It is not the sound of defeat It is the sound of singing that I hear God yeah. so, 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 sound of what Sound of singing Hey what do you It is says mm. when Moses approached the camp and saw the calf and the dancing Ah uh, yes sir his anger burned and he threw the tablets out mm. of his hands, mm. breaking them to pieces at mm. the foot of the mountain. Let me tell you, just hold on, please. If music is not correctly used, it appears to go for a certain time. Kama neno la mungu haitui wiki vizuri, you will serve the devil. Itaka kama sa wimibo za Christo. Ndiyo sababu Joshua anauliza. Na hii mimi nasikia ni ya Kristo kweli. Tutakuwa na Isaiah hapa kwa mwezi mimi wewe wewe wa Yehova. Hizi ndimo za wewe wa Yehova. Nasikia. Yesu Kristo anashindwa. Tutafautisha. Ndipo za dunia na ndipo za asilia. Hata mimi nasikia. Ndio nasaka kwa Joshua. What kind of songs are we singing to support? What kind of songs are we singing so that these other children will enjoy the choir was here in the city? Am I complicated? Yes. Yani imekuwa kama kelele. Haijapenda sifa kwa Mwenyezi Mungu. Lakini inakuwa kama ni wimbo wa nini? Ya vita. Na wimbo wa vita ya nani? Haili pole pole Hakuna vile utakuwa mwimbaji na utaki maombi. 
Hallelujah, can you say? Amen. That's why we lack the foundation. We left Jesus Christ long time ago. To be done, we are going to be able to do it. We are going to be able to do it. We are going to be able to do it. We are going to be able to do it. We are going to be able to do it. My 
yote mliniuliza niliwapea sauti nimekupea uhai nimekupea ilikuwa gharama ambapo mkataa kufanya kunifanyia kazi ilikuwa gharama wakati ile sakwa gharama urembo ile sakwa gharama because we maintain gharama kazi ile sakwa gharama sababu hauna tani kuja ku practice nidhamu ile sakwa gharama sababu Yesu anasema kwamba if you want to follow me must have your self na kwa kwa hapo hao hawali badeji yeah Oh, 
walipata kwao. Hiyo ni mimaleni waletea mchana ya leo. Takuwa kwa ukipata uwe wangu. Mabaya ni Yesu Christ. Wamemaini kwa dana ya gereza sababu wamesamama kwa ukwe. Tijila. Hamesamama. Kwa tika kwa gira sister. Yes. Yes. Thank you for. Receiving the orders, the orders, he put them in the inner cell and fastened their feet in the stalks. Mm. About midnight, mm. Paul and Silas were praying and singing hymns to God. What you call a family, brothers and sisters? Praying and singing. What you call a family? Praying. What kind of shit are you going to do with Christ? What kind of family? These people are praying and singing. I'm going to have a family that's not a family that's not a family. You need to find God inside your head. Look at your point of view yes. Kama unaweka ukisini na unajua ndani ya kwao. Usema kwa hiyo tutoa mbali. Kama unaweka classes ndani ya kanisa. Sababu umekata maombi. Tuende tuwe. Hakuniso kwa kuna mali zinaenda. Hata hizo bomba kuna mali zinaenda. Wacha kwao. Hata kwako kama uombi. Kuna mali zinaenda. At midnight, kuna kitu wale kumbuka, wale kumbuka na wana. Misingi Yesu, ni Yesu Christo. Tumewekwa hapa nani, sito kumekosa. Tumewekwa hapa nani, sababu tumesumamea haki. Hii kuna kafuta moja wa wawiri. In the congregation today, ambaye kasumama na Yesu kukweli. Ambaye kasi who will sin with understanding. Kia kwa kuna kuhiba na kuna kuhiba na kuna kuhiba na start. Yuhu ni kia kwa 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 About midnight, Paul and Silas were praying and singing hymns to God, and the other prisoners were listening to them. Suddenly, there was such a violent earthquake that the foundation of the prison was shaken. Alleluia! The power of music, the power of prayer. Malenu naona yakamba umesiwa brother. Watia mungu. Kusisi, ni mkuu alayeka ya kambi. Kama kuna kitu mbuma na kukua nero na director Wanambawa wana kukula kichwa Wata kukua ewa wile wanatani Lakini About many nights Wale kukuku wale jua ya kuwamu Kuna mtu Kuna muwamu Ambayo kuki mbongo Itatua maji ya usema Aleluya Yes Ambayo yesu Never give up Soja home Hawa watu wali kumbu, wali 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 njibu za Christo? Mutaniwezi. Paulu na sila wali wali njibu za Christo? Hakuna. Na wewe, wanakuwa, ata na number three, ujui. Mbisi mbubu ya mbubu. Mbubu. Number one, njibu za Christo. Mbubu. 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 Wanafunga kudongo, wanafunga na hima na kuna kikina ibe. Na kina watu wanichapa neno. Sikuku walikuwa na reka hapa. Wini mwanakuwa ya kena kwa mtaki. Wadhe, mwusu wa kisikuwa kena kwa mtaki. Awa wende hapa bibia wanya. Kuli dadea kudimukufu. Bibia, ukimuambia bebe. They are very smart. Wanda kwa kuli niyo sile katogo. Alafu kanotu kukile spiral. Na kalami kwa wako wako. Na osana nika, yu kiswa yu kiswa yu. Yu wana kapa wako mbewe ye. Musiyali. After nighting, inafungu wa hapu. Na nakole yu nakule ya ni. My friend, that's not here. You need to be prayerful and you read that of the Bible day by day. Not day, day by day. So that anything, anything happens. You have something to refer to. Last last month we were going to have a party. I love food. Okay. Translate. It's a cost of money. Go to 
ilikuwa ndani ya dai usiku post past hour so it was bila kwa mwaka yetu watu walikuwa na lalo so nikastuka nimemwomba watu pandei tena nikamwomba watu pandei mimi nimekata kwa mama akapiga kelele wao wakapiga kelele kele. mimi nikanyamasa very God had taken control that he could have said it's too strong at all about it. It will lose money to chop up a day, lose money to chop up a day, lose money to chop up a day, then God took control. What was that? 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 ilibidi nisimamu. Na ndio tatu minutes wanasomea bila. Kwa hiyo nilikuwa na ama nilikuwa bila hivi. Bravo za sisters. Barabara iko na mambo mengi. Hii safari ya imani iko na mambo mengi. Usidhani kwa kwa kusimama. Usiwe kwa sawa. Usiwe kwa kwa wewe ndio kuiba so. Uko sawa. Usina kwa kweli unajua kuhubiri uko sawa. Sasa kwa tu ndio kwa name that for my but your name. I told them my brothers and sisters. Hata hii gari ambao mwana nirudi hapo. Si ngufu ya driver. Ni Mungu ametea control. Tafadhali tuelekee tu ndani. Tuendelee na safari. Then I told them again I mean I mean kwa nani ndio tunatujua watu. Sema tunatujua watu tukiwa sawa unatujua tukisema sikaelewa sasa kwa 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 sasa sitaki mtu yote aongee hapa mimi nitaongea ndani ya bus mimi kila mtu akimama nikasimama kwa driver pale i want us to play na tukaomba tukafika sasa nasemaje so katika hizo fanya ya imani please don't take it for granted Uimbaji wako imeokoa wangapi? 
Ukristo wako inaokoa wadani. Habari zetu I read verse 26. Mm. Suddenly there was such a violent earthquake mm. that the foundations of the prison mm. were shaken. Mm. At once all the prison doors flew open mm. and everybody's chains mm. came loose. Mm. The jailer woke up and mm. when he saw the prison doors open, mm. he threw his sword mm. and was about to kill himself because he thought the prisoners had escaped. But Paul shouted, mm. Don't harm yourself. Mm. We are here. Because they were at the feet of Jesus. Verse 29. Mm. The jailer called for lights, mm. rushed in and fell trembling before mm. Paul and Silas. Mm. He then brought them out and asked, mm. Sons, mm. what must I do? What are you asking to do? What? Saved. To be saved. What I mean, the society is asking you today, what must I do to be saved? How many of you have to do this? I don't know what to do. 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 What must I do to be saved? Why are you jealous? Yeah, I'll be nothing. I'll be nothing. I'll be nothing. I'll be nothing. The power of music. What do you do? Please. Put God first. And after putting God first, what do you find in your life?